Hi everybody, I'm Jody, and thank you so much for joining me today. Today's video is going to be over a perfume review over my Burberry Blush. It's a newer release perfume, and I thought I would just tell you my thoughts about it. And I hope that you enjoy these perfume videos. If you do, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also that little bell because every time I upload a video, you'll be notified if you hit the bell. So don't forget to do that. And if you're already a subscriber to my channel, thank you so much and welcome back. And let's go ahead and jump right into this review. This is the actual outer packaging of my Burberry Blush perfume. Now this is the Eau de Parfum and this is the 3 point fluid ounce which is 90 mils and it has Burberry on the top. Just a really pretty blush color packaging with the gold ribbon and it's all the way around. It's really pretty. Um, I think it's kind of an elegant looking box. Let's go ahead and actually see what's inside the box. Okay, so this is the actual product here. This is the bottle here. And this of course is a flanker. They have my Burberry, they have my Burberry Black, and now they have my Burberry Blush. Wow, that's a tug twister there, blah, 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 blah. Um, but it's really pretty. And they all have this particular, you know, square bottle with the large lid on it. Look at that lid, isn't that pretty? And this one of course has the blush ribbon on it. And I thought today I'd wear kind of a blush top just to go with it, color coordinate. And of course, the trim here is gold and the writing on the front is gold, my Burberry blush. So I'm gonna tell you about the notes of this perfume and then tell you about how I feel about this perfume. But I'm gonna go ahead and spray this and here's the, the sprayer here just your simple sprayer and I'm going to show you how it sprays oh, it's it just it's really a nice spray it's you know very and you want to kind of mist it from a distance and I always put two squirts on my arm that's just me you might be different but that's just me so let's go ahead and jump right into the notes and then I'm going to kind of tell you how I think this smells just because you know perfumes are hard to come across on video so i'm going to tell you my opinion about this perfume okay so the notes are uh, the top notes are lemon pomegranate the middle notes are rose petals green apple and geranium and the base notes are jasmine and wisteria and that's exactly what this uh, fragrance is it's very floral it's very beautiful and I kind of wrote something um, I jotted down some notes because I did wear it and I jotted down some notes um, of how I felt about this fragrance and I think this perfume opens as a citrus floral a crisp tartness backing with a floral punch the dry down brings a softer floral fragrance but every once in a while you'll get a swift sniff of like the tartness it does make this fragrance interesting, but it is the kind of fragrance that can make you um, kind of feel overwhelmed or it can kind of choke you if you overdo it, if you overspray. Of course, I always overspray. I tend to do that. Rose is a note in the fragrance, but it's not prominent to me. I feel like what's more prominent are the jasmine and the wisteria. I don't really smell a whole lot of the rose, but it is in there. And of course, in my area, we have wisteria vines, and so it just kind of brings that memory back to me. So I really like that. And overall, I would say that this perfume is a combination of tart floral and just a hint of sweetness. But it's not like a gourmand sweetness or anything like that, not syrupy sweet. It's just a softer um, floral. Once it dries down, at first, you know, you do get that citrusy uh, punch in the beginning. And then it just gets a kind of lighter as it, you know, stays on your skin and melds with your skin. So it's a very, very beautiful fragrance. And I do enjoy this fragrance. And of course, the longevity, it doesn't last a very, very long time, like, you know, 10 hours or anything like that. But I would say probably a good, you know, four to six hours, kind of in that range. 
Um, you can still smell it on your skin, but it's very light. Like the silage is not there. You can't smell it. Like if you walk into a room, someone's not going to say, oh, what are you, you know, what are you wearing? But now if they kind of come into your personal space, they will, you know, be able to still smell like a hint of it. I did wear it to work. I did get quite a few compliments about it and said, you know, they thought it was very um, feminine and floral and they thought it was a very a fresher floral scent something that would be good for spring summertime a lighter fragrance something very um, zesty citrusy so overall i really enjoy this fragrance i think this is one of and i haven't smelled my burberry i have um, did get the my burberry black which is something that i've talked about before and it didn't really work for me but this particular one my burberry blush i think is really really a beautiful fragrance and i do recommend this fragrance to you so i hope that you can you know go out check it out um, maybe get a sample or go and try it on a test strip or spritz it on your wrist when you're out you know at the mall or sephora or um i think macy's has it and also i think ulta has it so yeah just go and uh, check it out i hope you enjoy it as much as i do so thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this review i hope it helped you decide whether or whether or not to purchase this perfume um, if it is something that you are wanting to purchase i would love to know um, if you already have it in your collection and i would love to know your thoughts about it whether you like it or you don't like it so yeah just leave me some comments down below and of course like i said if you're not already subscribed it's very very important you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the bell so you'll be notified next time i upload another review another video and if you're liking these perfume videos i would love to know i love hearing from you i love chatting with you and so thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you in my next video bye y'all